Hello friends, good evening once again and welcome here sa ating munting kusina. Welcome here at La Arnie's Kitchen and Food Creations. Tonight, I would love to share what's going on from day to day experience here sa ating kusina. Ako po ay magluluto ng balanghoy or kamuting kahoy at lalagyan ko siya ng gata or coconut milk so this is yuca or cassava so what i did i'm going to chop that both ends and then peel it babalatan ko po okay friends yan po ang balat or skin sa ating uh, cassava or kamoting kahoy discarded po yan and then after na mabalatan tadaro na ako no? I'm going to chop this one according to the desired sizes of your cassava so hinati ko dahil the, at the middle portion meron po siyang strand or yung mga ano sa tawag ano niya <laughs> Okay, kumana good friends, no? Atong ibutang sa atong cooking pot. We're going to put this into our cooking pot. So once we place this into our cooking pot, I'm going to add two, two cans of coconut milk. This is very creamy coconut milk. So per can... Uh, equivalent po niya is 2 cups. This is 400 ml. So, dalawa po ang ilagay natin. Ilalagay natin. <laughs> Okay. Then add lang po natin ng brown sugar. If you run out of brown sugar, you can use muscovado sugar or white sugar. Friends, adding sugar, it depends upon your taste buds. So I'm just doing this in an approximate basis. And you can also try to add some, a little bit of salt so that it will balance uh, the taste and it will normalize or neutralize. <laughs> okay. Mix it. Adding salt or a little, adding a little salt or sugar. It depends upon your own discretion. Okay. I have to turn this on and put cover and set this aside for now until this is cooked uh, until this is fully cooked friends i am using over a medium flame friends be mindful that the coconut milk will not overflow otherwise you will end up cleaning <laughs> your mess. So mix them po natin. So this is not yet done. We will wait until the absorption of the coconut milk. Okay, there you go. Okay. 
so great friends another five minutes then this is good I'll have to cover it back and set this aside for another five more minutes okay friends let's check whether this is cooked so we're going to poke this with knife okay perfecto this is done my dear friends friends luto na po ang ating ginataan na cassava or yuca or kamoting kahoy or balanghoy we call that balanghoy in bisaya okay there you go so i'll have to turn off my flame voila and then i'll have to transfer it into my uh, bowl serving bowl ito po ang aking serving bowl i'll have to transfer this finished product into my serving bowl okay there you go wonderful friends thank you very much for watching larney's kitchen and food creation still the next time so i want you to try this if you have uh, access to cassava or balanghoy then very very easy type of cooking so this will serve as dessert and for snacks so once my husband will come from work then he can have this one i always prepare something to eat right after his work thank you friends bye for now god bless